Mic check, mic check, mic check, mic check. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything seems good. All right. All right. Oh, hello, Kojina. Hello, hello. Hi, Konkuro desu. Masori Kuraka desu. Yoshiku naigashimasu. Hi, Konkuro desu. And yeah, um, Happy Lunar New Year. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, we call it Lunar New Year. Like, like not just Chinese New Year, though. Yeah, it's, it's a follow to Lunar New Year. So, <laughs> but no problem, no problem. Anyway, yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, I wish everyone a very happy Lunar New Year. Yay! Hi, 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 hi. Oh, hello, Protonicness. Welcome, welcome. Happy Lunar New Year to you. <laughs> yeah, hey, hey, hey. More nights, slow. <laughs> More nights. Yeah. Yeah, I. As a more morning or night door. Well, Konkuro des. Hi, 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 hi. So, yeah, it is today is the、um, first day of 2021, according to Lunar New Year. Yeah. In,、uh, in my place, that's what they call m u m o t e Yeah, something like that. m u m o t e Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah.、Uh, oh, speaking about that, it's, it's very、um, funny that、uh, I just happened to find a lot of people's VTubers happens to be、uh, Vietnamese and、uh, they are also、uh, celebrating the Lunar New Year as well.、Mm, yeah. It's a little something I invented. Yeah. More nights. More nights. Wherever you are. That, that's why they, they have the.、Um, Hello and konnichiwa and yeah, konkuro desu. Hi, 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 hi. So, hi, hi, hi. Have my underlings been a good boy today? Have been a good boy this year? Because, as a tradition of that holiday, we have lucky money. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyone want some lucky money? <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.、Uh, I actually don't, remember, don't know how that tradition c o m e to be, but,、um, but yeah, by、uh, the Lunar New Year tradition, we usually uh, give uh, mostly adults who usually give s the, the, the kids、uh, lucky monies in red envelopes. This is. Yay! 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 Lucky money for your underlings. Well, it's not, not necessary adult to kids, though. They,、uh, they also、um, give lucky monies to、uh, elders as well. Like,、um, you know, like a good blessing. Lucky money. Yeah. So, I have lucky money. Yeah! Yay! So, one for you, Kojina. One for you, Noob Man. I think you're a generic guy. If I'm not mistaken. And one for you, Proto Witness. Yay! Yeah, hey, hey, hey. Wish you all a very, very good year. Well, now it's the officially、um, 2021, according to、uh, both the.、Uh, Boat calendars. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So,、um, yeah, I was just, there's, there's a lot to、uh, talk about that.、Um, mostly about tradition things. We、uh, did、uh, a lot to prepare for the New Year's thing. So,、um, I didn't really、uh, talk much, not, not gonna lie. I, I held a bit on、uh, the,、uh, you know, family stuff. And、um, you know、uh, that、uh, last night was supposed to be a commission drawing stream? Well, I forgot that it's in,、uh, the、uh, last, last day of the last year, according to Lunar Calendar. So、um, we actually sit、um, around and、um, feast 
the last last year of the year, and we watch some uh, annual TV shows. Yeah, it was it was kind of lame, not gonna lie. But um, you know, it can cannot be dead holiday without it. <clears throat> yeah, so I I had to cancel it, and then after that, after that TV show ends, which is some. It's already something like uh, 10 p.m., so it it started at uh, 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. So I totally can cancel out the stream. So after that, I uh, went play with Bill, get him to for a bit until um, 12 a.m. Yeah, 12 12 12:30 a.m. or something like that. Until there are fireworks. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. That sounds fun. Uh, well, kind of. Well, at least I kind of sounds a little bit more excited than um, uh, my previous that holiday because, uh, well, I get to share all these experience with you guys. You know, my underlings. This is the uh, first year that I actually have opportunity to do it. So, um, yeah, I guess I am more excited than usual. Not, not that I show that side though. <laughs> well, um, yeah, we had to prepare a lot of stuff. Uh, also, uh, made uh, some. Um, we always eat some some kind of food pie. Is it pie? It's even called pie. It's called um, bánh trưng. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We uh, we bake them. It's um. It was made uh, using uh, rice, rice, and uh, you put um, what is it? Um, I I'm not sure how what what do you call it in English. It rice and you put the uh, meat and all kind of stuff inside, and uh, you uh, use the leaf to cover it up, and then you put it in a big um, to, yeah. Sorry, I'm not really. Um, Go with English with this this one because uh, not gonna lie, I, I don't even know know what they are call it in my language. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, we uh, made a lot of those, like uh, 2022 of those pie or something. Bánh trưng. Yeah. Yeah. So um, this is not actually kind of a sweet pie or something, but um, more like some something you eat during dinner, right? Yeah. 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 Oh, also it. If my voice is, uh, as always, if my voice or my BGM is a little bit too low or too loud, let me know. Yeah. I think I saw a movie about those moon pies recently. Um, moon pies, moon pies. Um, I I don't think those are actually called it moon pies though. I think moon pies are. Um, is it? Does it call it moon pies? I, I don't know. I don't know. Let, let me check. Let me check. But uh, I, I don't think they're called moon pies. If uh, I recall, moon pies, moon pies. No, no, oh, it's what the fuck is this? It's, it's moon pie. No, 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 not really. Uh, if you mean moon cake, no, 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 not not the moon cake, not the moon cake. Um, the moon cake is the moon cake is the one you uh, made uh, during um, mid mid autumn. No, it, it was it was not the moon cake. It was not the moon cake. It's it's different. It's different. Like so, um, it's um the the moon cake is some something you bake during the. Uh, Mid Autumn Festival, right? Chung Thu, some kind of that. But uh, this Bánh Trưng is it's not like that. Let, let me uh, give you some images, image, images. Yeah, so um, you, it, it's not it's not the kind of sweet cake like um, it's not the kind of sweet cake like mooncake or any kind of pie or anything. It's actually made with rice, and then you put meat and all kind of things inside, it, and you cover it with leaf, so uh, the outside would would be kind of green. It's green. It's green. The thing is green. So yeah, 
Okay, I, I think I have a, a pick. Let me show you. It's um, it's look like this. Just just a sec, just a sec. Hold on, hold on. Uh, here we go. Okay, this one. Oh my god, it's so small. Okay, um, it's this um, this one. Yeah, this this is the one. This is the one. It's called Bánh Chưng, right? So the the thing is, uh, you uh, put um, rice and all kind all kind of uh, flavors and meat and into it, and uh, you cover it with leaves <laughs> like that. It's all organic thing, you know. It's not like mooncake. Mooncakes are are made during uh, mid mid autumn festival, which is different. This is in the, in the middle of year, mid autumn festival, right? This this is the uh, the kind of cake that that you uh, made uh, during the um, lunar new year. Like, remind me of the, the Kata stuff. Makes me remind remind me of Wada. Not gonna lie, like uh, is, is he still refusing to to go into twist? Yeah. So this is what is inside looks like. A mooncake easy to make. Um, these are not mooncakes. Like like I said, this is these are not mooncakes. These are not mooncakes. Um, let me just say it's uh, it's not mooncake, right? Now this kept me hungry. Um, yeah, this um, you know like the mooncakes is um, you eat it during after or outside of the the main the main meal. This one you can actually eat during the main meal, like uh, lunch or dinner, in the middle of it, with, with, uh, along with all kinds of chicken meat and everything else. Have you been enjoying your vacation? Um, well, it's not not really a vacation. It's um, it's a holiday rather than a vacation, right? A, a vacation that uh, you you go somewhere far. It's more like uh, a holiday. It always has been, but well, it's kind of different this year. Like um, usually, we would have this uh, du during us first, the uh, January first of Lunar New Year. We would go visit our relatives and uh, you know collect some lucky monies and all kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah. But um, yeah, because of the COVID thing, you know. All kind of stuff. So we, we just kind of everyone just kind of staying home and watching movies and you know everything else. Like um, we do have some relatives uh, to uh, go though. Some relatives do come come by and uh, they, they will come by uh, for for a few few more days. Yeah, during the uh, holiday. Yeah. So um, yeah that. That's a cake. That's a pie. Bánh chưng, bánh chưng, right? It's different from bánh trung thu. It's different from bánh trung thu. This is bánh chưng, right? Yeah. So um, yeah, I actually don't usually this excited with uh, this kind of holidays, but I get to share with you guys. Yeah, kind of. Well, literally just made everything in the background like uh, just uh, an hour ago. Yeah. <clears throat> um. Actually, during this day, I kind of, you know, like, I kind of tend to sleep until freaking 9 a.m. So I haven't really done anything at all. And uh, oh yeah, I um, I went back to my uh, my old house the other day. For some stuff, yeah. Did I tell you that uh, I'm I'm not living in my old house anymore? I'm actually living with dad and sister at my grandparent house. Yeah, I, I think I told already told you during my debut, my parents divorced and uh, I had to move to my grandparents' house. Yeah. So with that aside, <clears throat> yeah. So I went back to my my old house the other day like um 
about um, maybe uh, yesterday was it yesterday yeah I, I think I think it was yesterday and um, yeah I got to I uh, dug up a few things from my old stuff you know and I found some real cool things some some stuff I, I brought some stuff with me here like um, a tons of um, anime DVDs and uh, light novels and some of which I haven't even finished yet and I brought them here with me even my old um, notebooks that is this case more art um, yeah um, no probably just um, the old um, the old arts I have in yeah, some some old art but uh, let me just show you some of the things I have dug up some stuff I have dug up from from my old old stuff that I found at my old house not really though just some anime like novels things no let me see let me see um, let me see there we go this thing yeah <laughs> Tokyo stray wizard I have I haven't even I haven't even read this one yet Tokyo stray wizards and uh, I have not actually read this one though so uh, I don't really know what it's like so I'm um, just I, I really don't I haven't read this one yet, so I don't know. Other than that, this is the Tokyo Stray Wizard. What are those men? I have, I haven't, I haven't even read them, so I don't know. But uh, I wish I have some more time to read these books because I haven't really have much things on my hand right now. But yeah, these. I don't think any of you can uh, read the uh, Vietnamese, so I'll just say to you that um wait 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 let, let me see let me see <clears throat> let me see I, let me see uh it's uh both of these are f by uh shinkai makoto the one in the right is uh the garden of words koto no ha no niwa oh yeah Oh yeah, paper book ASMR. Oh yeah, I love it. I think they have bigger uh, pretending to read. Uh, I think it's it's written somewhere around here. Like, uh, where is it? Where is it? I'm not sure it's written somewhere around here. But uh, the one on the right is uh, the Garden of Words, Koto no Hanoniwa. Yeah, by Shinkai Makoto. Both of these are from Shinkai Makoto. The one on the left is called uh, The Voice from a Distant Star. Uh, I don't think they've written it in here, but um, both of these are really cool. If you haven't watched the anime yet. Also, Shinkai Makoto used to uh, have, have tend to uh, write the light novels differently from the anime. So uh, you might experience it differently from um, people watching the anime version. Books ASMR, this is so good, man. It's so good. Yeah, these are. I love these these ones so much. I kind kind of love reading books. Really loves reading books. But you know, I'm also a weep, so these these are the best I can. The. Uh, ASMR, kinda. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know if, if you can even hear them though, because uh, I, I don't know if you can even hear them. Yeah, because uh, I don't think my mic is that good, but never mind that. Yeah, the um. 
Yeah, talk about a little bit of these light novel things. The uh, I think I bought these light novels. Most of these, oh, I think ev every single one of these I uh, bought uh, during my uh, within uh, three years of my high school and um, the uh, three to four years of my college years. So within those seven years, these are. One of those books that I bought, and Shinkai Makoto, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. You, sh you all should give it a try. And um, <clears throat> the uh, a voice from a distant star. I didn't really know what what attracts me from this books, but um, well, I bought them anyway. As I say, it's impressive, really impressive. All the books I have read. Very impressive. I I mean I didn't bought it for no freaking reasons, right? Pretty cool, pretty cool. And some more. What's the difference between light novels and novels? Are light novels lighter while novels are heavier? <laughs> um actually that's that's a very good one. I um I don't know. Yeah I I, I don't know either. Like novels and novels. Mm. Well, this is only my uh, subjective point of view that, uh, you know, most of those uh, like novels, like novels. I think is that uh, like novels are like uh, to, um, I think the lighter like novels are lighter and novels are heavier it's like um I, I think it's not wrong but uh, in the emotional feeling like um, it feels like uh, light novels are much easier to read than no normal novels like something like the great Gatsby or something from Dazai Osamu or things less most of them are for you know like teenagers and um, people at our age, lots of like animes and stuff, so it makes us uh, a little bit more easier to approach, so yeah, I, I guess you can call it lighter in some ways. Yeah, just like that. And you know, usually those light novels, they usually have anime pictures as well, so uh, that's it. one one part why it is um, lighter, easier to read easier to approach and some of them are even in uh, smaller size smaller size like like just just like a notebook uh, I, I don't know what what should I uh, call that that kind of size it's um, like how much like like uh, this one the um, Tokyo stray wizard thing Oh god, I, I just opened it. Spoilers! Spoiler, I haven't read it. That's, that's a very cool picture inside. I'm just gonna take this um, Koto no, no Ha no Niwa Garden of Words from Shinkai Makoto as example. It has, uh, I think it's written the size of the book somewhere, yeah, 13 centimeters x 18 centimeters yeah something like that like a 13 18 with within those size yeah so yeah like um, some novels are very very big right like um, something like uh, 1.5 times bigger something like that something like that but you get what the idea is um, the light novels are well lighter in uh, lots of ways. So yeah, some other books I already uh, brought back are these. I think uh, most of you are please recognize these these books. I think you you could recognize these books. The uh, From the uh, yeah, well, unironically lighter, yeah, in some ways. So yeah, 
we have um, from the left to right. Welcome to the NSK. I'm and Yuki, children of the wolf or whatever they call it. And the uh, butterfly wrist thingy. What was it called? What's it called? Let's go. Oh, hello. It's just May. Welcome. 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 Just, uh, we're just chatting a little bit. Friday night chatting. Welcome to the Black Sun. I hope you're enjoying your stay. Hello, 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 hello. I hope you're enjoying your stay. Just kick back and relax. We're just chatting. So yeah, we have, um, Happy Lunar New Year. Yeah, Happy Lunar New Year to you too. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I haven't given you this. Yeah. Lucky money, yay! One for you too, May. There we go, yay! All right, that's tradition. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, from the books from the left to right, we have um, welcome to the NSK and Amen Yuki and uh, yeah, Wolf Children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's Wolf Children, Amen Yuki. Yeah, it's also that one. And the one from the right, it is called, uh, I don't actually remember, Hotarumi no Morie, yeah, by Yuki Midorikawa, great story, yeah, great story, great story. In fact, I think all, all of these books in here, like, uh, I, I will not tell about the uh, Tokyo Stray Wizard thing, it's anime stuff, you know, like, we weep stuff like uh, probably some isekai and magical fighting and all kind of stuff in Echi but um, rather than that Wolf Children, Kotaru no Morie, Welcome to the NHK, um, Garden of Words and A Call from the Distant Star. I have read them all and those are fantastic, absolutely fantastic, it you said. I didn't bring it here for no reason. See, Hotarubi no Morie is actually manga though. So it, it's not like novel, it's, ma it's manga. But they are good. They are good. They are absolutely good. Yeah. Maybe you're wondering. Um, I also have um, 5 centimeters per second. But um, I didn't brought it here with me because uh, it's uh, Bill's house. You know, Bill is living with his parents along with uh, our grandparents. So uh, I bought him, I actually bought a spare copies of uh, 5 centimeters per second and uh, I gave him one. So yeah, we, we have one right here. So I didn't brought it here with me. I don't know where, where he can keep it, but we have it here with me. So um, there's still a few more. These are, there are a few more, like, uh, and these are anime DVDs, like, uh, let's, which, which one to start? Let me see, let me see, just a sec, I need some water as well. Yeah. have these as well yeah so uh, I'm putting my laptop on top of the table so um, it's just a little just under my feet so let's see mm. let me see let me see uh, huh. okay let's Maybe let's start with uh, this, this one. All right, let's start with this one. Yeah. Okay. So um, from the left to right, I have um, selector infected wick sauce. And uh, let's see, where is it? Socia de Jinketsu no Maria. And Etotama. Yeah, these are 
anime DVDs. Select the... Let, let me zoom it for you. Mm -hmm. Select the infected quick sauce, Junkatsu no Maria, and Etotama. I, I bought it from a local anime shop. Like, we, we don't actually have it at the... I think, yeah. I had my entire collection back home when I left for school. Oh, that sucks. But, um, you know, honestly, that uh, I barely touch these anymore after I finish it, so... They are mostly for, you know, flexing purpose. Or whatsoever. So yeah, select the infected wixot. I have to say, that one is absolutely cool. Absolutely awesome. Sure. Oh yeah, DVD. I hope I hope I don't scratch it or anything. It's kind of dirty a bit, probably due to time, but uh, it's probably still doing good. I bring it here with me because uh, I think I can watch it using my uh, my laptop. If possible, I think it's possible. Select the infected wig sauce. The uh, I think you heard of the card game wig sauce. Anyone of you has heard of wig sauce? It's a very weird card game, really. I don't actually, um, I don't actually uh, recall how it is played. The wick sauce thing. Yeah, but um, okay. I, I'm reading on the back of, of the uh, this this box here, and um, yeah, 12 episode, 24 minutes per episode. Genre. Listen to this. Game. Psychological. Violence. Accurate. Fucking accurate. Pretty awesome. Ruthless. It's a. Uh, <clears throat> it's like a. Madoka Magica but Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, that that's to sum it up. It's basically Madoka Ma Magica in Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, it's kind of that. It's it's depressing as hell and. Yeah. I'm very cool. It uh, actually has uh, two or three seasons. I, the, um, the first season only, uh, which is in this DVD, is only the first season that half of the story and they uh, ended it, resolved all the problems. In the second season, it's a uh, selector infected wick sauce. You had me at violence, yeah. Yeah, I know, right? I actually like just kind of fuck it up stuff, you know, like um, Madoka Magica, this selector infected with sauce thing, Maho Soto Sight, Chainsaw Man, and uh, Oyasumi Pun Pun. I like those kind of stuff. Madoka Magica is depressing. Ooh, oh, you didn't know? You didn't know? It's um, go watch it. It's pretty good. Pretty good. You, you have to watch it, like, yes, it's depressing, and violence as well. I have to say, it also falls into the psychological and violence genre. In fact, you, you probably might find some scenes pretty uh, kind of horror, something like that. It's, it's kind of, it's really burned deep in my mind how those uh, monsters, the witches, are designed. You all depressing stuff. Why not consider reading Berserk? Um, on that information, I have already read Berserk to the latest, the latest chapter, and I'm still waiting. I'm actually got you. I heard some people on the internet that um, the author of Berserk just uh, you know just uh, very very slowly releasing new chapters, and yeah. Yeah, I said I need to watch it. Mm -hmm. I've already read Berserk manga till the latest chapter. You don't have to tell me that. It's uh, not gonna lie. It's um, it's only kind of. It's not even depressing. It's just kind of fucked up. It's just kind of fucked up and. Uh, I think the the most interesting part is the uh, guts pass. But yeah, I've seen the movie at least three times. Slow. 
But yeah, you should watch Maruo Kamakika and uh, brace yourself. Yeah, because I like those kind of stuff. Like, uh, yeah, you know, the scream of innocent people and their minds and will are bent and broken and twisted and stuff. Maruo Kamakika is good. Yes, it's good. It's very good. It's very good. Hep also, like um, Maho Solo Sight, it's it only recently uh, releasing animes recently. I, I don't know which is recently because uh, the last time I watched the first an episode of that anime is like um, when I'm still at college. So yeah, I had to watch it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Three movies. Three movies. Maruka Magika. The, uh, if you watch the an if you find the uh, Madoka Magica that has uh, something like 12 or 24 episodes, it's, um, I think it's only like uh, season 1 or 2, uh, like movie 1 or 2 of Madoka Magica, you know? Like, yeah, just just watch the 3 movies. Just watch the 3 movies. Guarantee. 10 out of 10. Yeah. So yeah, I... yeah. So yeah, let's move on to something less depressing because I'm getting into very dangerous zones when we're here. Yeah, so let's get to the next one. Like uh, Jigetsu Murai. I remember my friends in Discord watched party all of them in one day. Well, it's like three movies, right? Like uh, three movies. Like um, if I remember, like uh, two hours, the standard time a movie. So that's like six hours just. You know, just watch it in in one afternoon. You can totally you can totally watch it all. Like it has movie as well. It's uh, I think it's originally movies. You have to watch the movies. Don't I? I actually have have not watched the the anime TV series, but watch the movies. Three movies. Three movies. Right. Three movies. That that is what I recommend. I think the, the anime TV series is only uh, the the story of the first movies or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But make sure you watch the movie. That's all. That's all I can say. So yeah. What was that? Oh yes. Jungesu no Maria. Uh, you know, she's a witch. Stop. Actually, not. Um, it's uh, not not really something like. Um, let me see. Not something that outstanding. You know? Oh god! Oh god! The this, the this, the this. I think it fell out. I think it fell out or something. It's not scratch or anything, but um, yeah. Yeah. Remember when we used to watch the movies with this and uh, you even know those big boxes thing I think I saw that first time when when I was like uh, two to three years old or something movie one and two are anime recaps and three is original yeah kind of I uh, hmm. I, I was I would say the opposite though like uh, yeah, so yeah, yeah, so you know, in the end, uh, it's kind of really, you, you can just uh, watch three movies, and you're done. You can also watch, you know what, I I think I actually have to watch the Maruka Magita anime TV series, and you know, see, see how it goes, and see what's the difference, right, so, you can get to the Maria thing. It's a uh, witch plot thingy. The uh, witch Maria use usually use her magic to uh, to deal with the uh, world peace, blah blah blah. And then one day, uh, the heavens uh, make a judgment that she will lose her power if she lose her virginity. Stop. Something like that. But yeah, it's. It's cool, it's cool. 
it's cool like uh, not nothing out the extraordinary but uh, it's good it has stories it's good and the third one is the etotama why are all these fell out of the disc box etotama oh my god i love i love the smells i love the smells okay yes he even smells the uh, this box and uh, smell books. Like, give me one. Give me one. Let me see. Ah, uh, yes. Book smell. Love it. Love it. Mm hmm. Etotama is like a. The Zodiac. They fight. Yeah. Just like that. It's uh, anime stuff. Yeah, it's just like a not nothing much. But well, I do recommend you uh, watch the three movies of Marokama Rika. Yeah, also the next one is um. This, this sounds like a hentai plot. No, it's not a hentai plot. It's just a. Uh, it's not even edgy. It, it's just um. Some casual anime things, you know, casual anime things. Okay, so this is the next one. Okay, I got some spicy stuff. Okay, I got Law Horizon, Kantai Collection, Damachi Season 1, and Ore Tinteo Ninarimas. Ore Tinteo Ninarimas. These are worth watching. Wake Sauce is also worth watching. I heard Hentai plot what y'all are talking. What the fuck? No, we're not talking about Hentai. No, no, no. No, 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 we're not talking about hentai today. We'll go into hentai on another stream. Pop Law Horizon. Yeah, I. It's season one though. 25 episode. Like, remember. Remember when, when animes were 20, 24, 25 episodes a season? Yeah, good days. Good old days. Law Horizon. I haven't watched season two though. But uh, season one, I <clears throat> it's pretty good. But um, one thing I think, uh, uh, one one thing I I really don't like about animes in general, other animes in general, like uh, they go into a lot of the details of the uh, the um, the uh, mind battle thing. Not, not really into that stuff. But yeah, most... You think the Law Horizon would be some kind of, uh, you know, like Sword Art Online or something? No, it's not. It's still people isekai into a game world. You know, classic isekai plot thing into a game world. But uh, this thing is more political. It's more politics. Strategy. Stuff. And well, they get into a lot of big brain stuff too deep into those big brain stuff so um i think they would you know like yeah so that i mean it's tv oh wait is there two this just two this what are two this for i think it's um oh yeah 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 so one on this is for the uh about the uh, 12 or 13 episodes and uh, the other this would be the rest. Okay, so the next one is the um, Kantai Collection. Yeah, I have Kantai Collection as well. Ah, uh, yes, the Kantai Collection. I remember watching these on my second year of high school. With the boys, we would uh, hang out at the can canteen. Yeah, Kantai Old Battleship goes, yeah. Yeah, like, um, how many years has it been? Damn, boy. How many years has it been? I heard... I kind of wanted to try Kantai Collection back then, but uh, I heard that um, the uh, the registration account... The registration... The registration of that game is... Kind of confusing, like um, 
the sad thing is kind kind of like winning a gacha itself. So um, in the end, I didn't get into it. But uh, I really like the design of the abyssals, abyssals or whatever. This thing has top abyssal, top abyssal, yeah. But uh, I remember sitting in the canteen with the boys every Tuesday when the anime came out and watch it online and uh, we would whoa damn boy look at those those the uh, effects those water effects in in the boom boom pound and all kind of stuff yeah good old times good old times and well I think back in those days 3d anime CGs would be I think yeah there's a slight delay I mean, wasn't there always a slight delay? I mean, yeah, I think you usually get that slight delay during stream, like always. Don't mind it, don't mind it. I'm still listening to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Imagine this day, but everybody talk about our zero lanes. Yeah, our zero lane. Yeah, 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 yeah. Still prefer Kantai Collection, though. A zero lane is kind of, oh boy, a lot of edgy stuff, isn't it? Yeah, a lot of edgy stuff. A lot of edgy stuff. Have you even seen the costume of a zero lane girls? Right. Yeah. So then, the third one is uh, Damachi. That's a lot of the yeah. Damachi, Damachi. Yeah, 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 yeah. The uh, familiar myths. I, I'm gonna try reading the titles. Uh, what is the titles? Danjani something something. Oh, Meruno na something Meruno wa something something Teiru Daroka. Familiar myth. Yep. I don't know how to read kanji. Fuck it. Damachi. Well, it's meh. It's meh. Overrated. Not gonna lie. Overrated. Like, you know, these kind of, um, the kind of isekai thing or the kind of, that has the plus of, of a world building that's similar to game mechanics. Yeah, it's kind of a thing. I, I don't like them. I, I don't really like them. It's kind of lame, you know, like, no, not really, not really, just go, just go be, be some monster and get some chicks, things like that. You know what, I, yeah, how to kidnap the girls in dungeons, that's how I mistake to <laughs> read the initial, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're not wrong though. It's basically translator. Okay, it's okay to to pick up a girl on a, you know, from a dungeon. Like, uh, isn't it the same? Isn't it the same? Yeah. So these things are worth. I, I think like they are worth in like novels than animes. Like I have never actually um, read the like novels of this stuff because I don't even like the anime. It's way too overrated. Yeah, it's way too overrated. Waifu materials. Yeah, like, you know, waifu materials. Something like that. In fact, on the plot, I think the fourth one of this is much more interesting. Twin Tail Ni Narimas. I, I think the light kinda covered it a bit. I think the light covers it a bit, but uh, I think a different picture later. There you go. Yeah, so, um, Twin Tail Ninaimas. Well, it's, it's simple. It's about Twin Tail Girls. And, like, uh, you know, the, the plot is like, um, there are these monsters, they invade the universe, and uh, 
some more will get lost as you are lane. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there, there is this... There is this, um, you know, these type monsters, and they are powered by, uh, by the fetish. Yeah, you know, like uh, some some monster, like uh, um, literature girl traits or tight traits or short hair trait. Yeah, that kind of things. And uh, guess what is the most powerful trait in the universe? Twin tails. Twin tails. That's a good tool under. Twin tail fetish anime. Yeah, the fetish anime. That thing. And should to be told, my wife will hear her twin tails. I love her so much. Shout out to Kuroka. Mwah. My wife will. Twin tails. I love twin tails. Twin tails are awesome. Ne never let anyone tell you different. Right? So, yeah. So, yeah, the uh, anime is that uh, powered by fetish. What kind of things? Is uh, the plot is actually not bad really, but uh, how many seasons are there? Because um, in I watched the whole thing and uh, there are there are a few characters that I I haven't even seen appearing yet. I haven't even seen them appearing yet. So uh, are there like? Um, Two seasons or anything, or just like, uh, or just just like the light novel things, because uh, there are more, there are more than just those characters in here. Like there's a red tail, there's a blue tail, and the yellow tail is it's kind of blurry in the pics. I'm I'm loading up the new pics just a sec. Yeah, there, there are some characters that haven't appeared in the anime yet. But um, the plot, surprisingly, for a uh, semi ecchi and uh, fetish anime thing, you know, like for fetish things, it's actually not bad. Actually, not bad at all. Monster powered by fetish. Did I hear that wrong? You didn't hear it wrong. It's exactly like that. Exactly like that. You, they are powered by by fetish, and they have to absorb those fetish to to survive. Yeah, they have to absorb the fetish to survive. So, yeah, <laughs> it's kind of like that. They, they all seem seems all weird that I come here to, <laughs> to take all your teen tears. Yeah. I don't know, except, you, you know, like, um, there's some, you know, example, like, like there's some monsters that, like, um, lowly, the lowly con monsters, and, uh, a bit absorb that. Is that lowly lowly traits? It's what I, I actually don't know how how it goes. Kind of so, but uh, you know, if, if they uh, absorb that trait, they will lose that trait, and uh, the person would totally lost interest and hopes and dreams of of that trait. Like the the twin tail was would no longer twin tails, just like normal hairs, and yeah, they they absorb fetish to survive. And they're powered by yeah. The plot for the monster is hard to explain to friends. <laughs> I know. I know. Powered, powered by fetish. That is, that is so. Lots of them are very relatable. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Lots of them are very relatable. Like, powered by feathers, yeah. Like, twin tail traits and. Fuck, that relate to that. They, they actually would, would want to touch the main character. Oh, um, 
did I say that main, the main character was a male? I mean, it's obvious now, but um, but uh, yeah, this one is that's actually a male, the the red tail one. Honor my friend. <laughs> so the main character is a trans. Yes. <laughs> Whoever makes the floss is highest. I know. Those guys are rather horny as hell. <laughs> I know, right? I know. It's, it's like, damn. Guys be, be like, uh, damn, I, I really would, would like to touch some, some twin tails right now. And, uh, yeah, he, he made some something like, um, the whole, uh, like novel thing about, uh, monster with fetish and, uh, Teen Hills addicted you know kind of things. Oh yeah, so uh wait let, let me rotate this one. Eh, 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 eh. Okay, this one. Okay that that's the build build laptop. I'm using it to uh stream. Don't mind that. This is this thing. Teen Tail Nina Yeah yeah, there, there are a few characters that not appeared in, in the anime yet. Which, which example is is this um, pink haired girl? It sounds nice, but our twin tail was jail. Yes. Oh well, don't jail it. I mean, how you look at my waifu? Jesus Christ, have you even look at my waifu? She has twin tails, she's hot as fuck. She's hot as fuck. She's my waifu. My. My. Like so. There are also this twin at the bottom here, like. Oh god. This this girl is like the, the biggest sim to to the twin tails. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. It's, she's, she give, give my, my energy. Hold on. Fuck! Fuck! Damn boy, love twin tails and, and all kind of stuff. Yeah, fuck! Fuck! Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that this? The twins that? Oh wait, I just, I think it, the twins and the twin tails like that's tails on each side, side tails or whatever. These also have haven't appeared in, in the anime yet. I don't know if they are they are in the uh, the light novels or the 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 the, the, the uh, second season anime or anything. If there's anything like that, but um, I haven't seen those characters. It's the, the pink haired girls. Yeah, so. Oh yeah, I also have this thing. I also have this thing. Chao tomate. Tomate. Yeah, my waifu. It's taken from one of my sketchbooks. This, this is from my art stuff. Kuroka. Yep, yep, my waifu. My waifu. I think it's um... It's not actually a drawing, it's actually um, one of the pictures I printed out at uh, the uh, printing booths at the mall or something. You know, when, when you take a picture and uh, they print it out, a few copies of it. I, I don't know what it's called. Uh, we don't usually have those over here, so yeah. These ones are way long ago, way, way long ago. And I, I had one for for my mom. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I'm seeing that there are a lot of cool stuffs in here. Like I, I haven't really oh god, got a bit too dude during my my high school year and uh, I'm probably oh these these are cool these are cool. 
there are these as well. I I think I still have them in in my. Uh, I think I still have the pictures of these in my folders. Let me find them. Let me find them. They are absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna love it. This one. This one. Uh, yeah, I also uh, pick it up uh, three of my uh, old sketchbooks. Yeah, this thing, this thing. Wait, wait, hold on. I'm gonna go by. Wait, shut up, mate, 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 mate. Okay, uh, this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's from from the same notebook. Are Twin Hill cool? If so, why? Like, look, man. Look, look, man. Like, do look at this. Twin tails. Yeah. Do do I even have have to spell it out? Like, duh. Like, duh! Do I even have to fucking spell it out? Like, Twin Tails are awesome. Like, yeah. So, yeah, these are the stuff. Yeah, sketchbook review. Some, something like that. Not actually sketchbook, though. Like, uh, be, during the time during my college, I, uh, usually, it's like most of these are, eh, kind, kind of complete. Okay, so. Yeah, these. The, um, I think I made this during one of my class at the, at the college. I don't really have much good memories of the college. So it was um, it was not gonna like quite um, terrifying. Like no nothing good out of it. Really, not nothing really good out of it. Yeah, I don't don't know where I got this from, but uh, I usually uh, have. Um, tend to do a lot of those patterns during drawings. Yeah, so there's another one as well. I think it's uh next to it. This one looks better so but uh mm, let me see let me see. I don't think I have it here but it's like on the next page. I didn't took any picture of it just now. oh here 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 it is here it is this one this one as well. It's literally just the page next to it. But I think I can also see the signature in the corner. Yeah, it's during my uh, college year. January 19, 2017. That's all. I was told to tell doubles as handlebar. Maybe the girl transformed into a bike or something. What the fuck was that? No, no, fuck that. No, what the fuck? No. No, 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 no. No, what the heck? That... Is this bullshit? Yeah, I'm gonna eat something. Fuck this shit. What the hell was it? Mm, yeah. Yeah, good. What else do I have? Oh god, there's also um the old script to my um college movies or something which uh obviously was not finished. Yeah, something like that. I think I'll just um See it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, this thing brings back a lot of memories. Let me just take a pic of this thing. This is a very... I think I've never shown anyone before, but... um, One of the... One piece of it. 
one drawing in one page of this thing are not actually my drawings. A few pages, because uh, I kind of lend it to my sister and other people a few times. Yeah. My, my cousins, my cousins, not my sister. Cousin's sister. Or whatever. I lend them once. But uh, not this one, not this one. This one is kind of a little bit special and um, I don't think I have talked about it before, like ever. Like um, you probably would see me uh, tweeting about it like a very vaguely I, like I tend to do that, like you know, mysterious and that kind of stuff. But um, I tend to treat this kind of thing, this specific topics, very vaguely. Like, like a uh, yo, what what do you know, right? But this one, I have never talked about this one before. Let me rotate this one. That is actually my uh, my laptop in the background, but don't mind that. Uh, here, this um, kind of a a topic, really. This one is kind of a hell topic. Let me just zoom out a little bit more. If you notice, this is some kind of doodles and it's a little bit different. And by the way, that's Kuroka in, in the back. But who's this? I gotta sleep now. Bye and good night, everyone. Well, good night. And hope you're happy, a happy new lunar new year to you. Yeah, go sleep, go to fucking sleep. So yeah. So I want you to pay attention into this one specifically. The one in the back uh, is uh, Kuroka. In case you haven't seen it yet, but yeah, Squid Dream. But the one in the front, who is that anyway? And by the way, that's also a girl. That is a girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, specifically, is that the one in, in the back, Kuroka, was with me, right? Like, uh, I, I don't... I think people already know that um, back when before I do the VTuber thing, I still use the Kuroka 06 models. Right here, see? The thing, not not actually a model. It wasn't even models back then. Come to a nice pick. Oh, hello, Tia. Welcome. We we're just talking about a very spicy. Oh yeah, I haven't. Happy Lunar New Year to you, Tia. And here's some lucky money for you, Tia. Lucky money for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So anyway, back in the topics. The person in the front is that's my ex. Oh, hello, guys, boys. Welcome. Hold on, hold on. Happy Lunar New Year. Here. Have, have some lucky money. Is it for you? Right? Happy Lunar New Year. Yeah, so, the one in, in the front of this picture here. What's my ex? And um, the whole thing on, on this page right here was drawn by my ex, my ex girlfriend. Mm, yeah. Yeah. We kind of dating for like um, three to four years or something before break. Right? We already broke up twice. <laughs> yeah. And um, I haven't really talked to her much. Um, for years 
Yeah, I've done four years. And uh, I haven't really meeting other girls ever since then. In fact, you know, that what um, I can't even hold five months, you know. But the thing is, um, four years and um, I was actually um, something like just a little kid, you know, like um, 16 years old back then. It's, I can say that's, that's one of the best, um, one of the best moments in my life. But it was a shame as well. But uh, she was um, very uh, a um, cheerful personality on the inside, on the outside. On the inside, she's um, actually more calculated and um, depressed than all you would think. Hmm. Yeah, well, it actually depends. You know, <laughs> reason I'm single. You'll get there. You'll get there. But um, yeah, I haven't met her in years. Um, you no. Know, you know, like the thing is, uh, just just because you like someone because of their good side. The important thing is you also have to accept the bad side, you know, the side that you don't like. That's where love is. And that's what the important part is. Lots of time I'm still figuring out where I did wrong. Can I stop that? Um, I have never really and enjoy life during before and after meeting her but um meeting her was the best gift I, I ever it was it was good time and um, you know like uh, imagine you give someone your whole world and you just walk and watch them take them the whole world away from you it's kind of like that. Mhm. Mm yeah, and um, I haven't meeting anyone since then. Like, um, I've been so indulged on by her image for the following years, years, even until now. The image of the ghost is still haunting me every night, every day. I try to forget her, but you know it's. Kinda hard to do that. Yeah, peg. Kind of. And um. Yeah. Who needs love when we have YouTubers? First love? Yeah, first love. And uh, probably the only. Love I uh, will ever have for a long, long time. You know, I'm 22, and by this point, I I know it's still kind of early for my age, but um, I kind of totally give up on on that that problem really. So yeah. So most of the time I'm spending now. It's um work. It's just work. I need to take to put these uh, DVD and books away. Mm -hmm. So yeah, for me like now, work, work, work. Just work, baby. And um. I've been through a lot of kind of pain in my whole life, but um, this specifically relationship 
was uh, one of the biggest hit in my life. There was a time, you know, like um, she gave me purpose. She gave me purpose, you know, like uh, one. Now imagine before that I was like um, I don't want to live anymore, and and ever since I met her, I was like I I keep drawing her like nonstop, like how I. How I usually draw Kuroka. She was in my mind every day, in in my every art I draw. And um, mm, yeah, she she was still in my mind, and there there was a reason for me to keep on going. Like uh, I. Like I always tell myself that I only need to push it a little bit more until I can get to see her again because um yeah we don't usually meet that much that might be a problem we only get to uh, meet each other like I was kind of introvert like I rarely kind of mother the courage to invite her out for a date. But um, yeah, like, yo, like I said, if I can't cannot be horny or meme, I'm just gonna be wholesome. Yeah, but uh, yeah, there was a time I was like, uh, I just need to keep keep on going one more day. I used to tell myself like that. I just need to keep one more day because I need to see her again. And then one day we, we just broke up, you know. It was me breaking up with her, you know. We kind of broke up twice, really. The first time she kind of ditched me, and we haven't even talked for a while, long while. And then, as a stupid ass as I am, I welcome her back. And during that second time. There's always that feeling at the back of my mind that, uh, you know, like, was it was this worked out? Was this worked out? And um, what what if someday, like, you know, something like that? There's always this anxiety. And then one day it actually is. She, um, I don't actually re- recall. What were we arguing about? And I think she actually um, insulted me for once. As a fucking chicken, I am. Um, I uh, kind of took it personally, and back then I really thought that. Really, I nearly uh, ditched my my dignity for this. For this girl, I mean, she's not a bad girl, but I nearly ditched my dignity for someone else. I, if I had to say it exaggeratedly, I nearly become a dog. I nearly become her dog. So yeah, I love her, but don't get me wrong. She's not a bad person. Like, I don't believe everyone, anyone, is entirely a bad person. Just, you know, we actually, um, we actually made out some, um, talked it out sometimes during my birthday last last year. Not the previous year, the last year, and um, uh, I spent I spent years still haunting about her. I try to forget her, like uh, I try to throw, put all the art I used to draw about her into one folder and just locked it away from my side. And uh, but um, she's still there. 
she's still there. I used to call her Rin. Me, I think maybe that's why. One of the reasons I don't know, because uh, when I see a person, I usually imagining them as her characters and um, love at first sight hit hard, friend. It's um. When, when I met her, it's actually, um... <laughs> Hello, narrow scan. Also, I forgot. Happy Lunar New Year to you, too. Um, lucky money for you. Yeah. But anyway... It's, it's hard to forget her, you know? Like, yeah. Bill is back. Happy Lunar New Year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Even if you lock it all away, memories is not easy to be forgotten. Well. Even like now, I'm still getting haunted by her image. I still have her uh, social medias and Twitters and Facebook and everything and um, but we don't talk much and but she's also very good at drawing. I would actually want to believe that she learned it from me. Inspired, yeah. In real life, temporary hentai is eternal. Yeah. Yo, what's up? I'm borrowing your laptop. You got house here, alright? I'm eating your, your crackers. Got Talk, talk like a drunk, drunk man. I'm, I'm not, not even drinking. I'm. The fuck, man. I'm in water. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Well, let me just open this thing on on my side so uh, I can. Um, I have to rate later, so. Let me just open this on my side first. Yeah, so Bill is back. Just a sec, just let me just open this on my side. So yeah, that was it. Love us first sight. It was actually when when I first met her, like um it was very, um, it was like a dream, not gonna lie. And, uh, you know, like, uh, at the same, we were at the same, uh, anime group or some shit for, for some wee kids. And, yeah, he actually asked me out, really. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Wait guys, just let me turn this on a bit. Mm. Crackers. What are these things? Nine vegetable chips. I don't know what that is. Dark theme created the dashboard. Okay, good, good, good. Good, good, good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Also, yeah, since my, um, my internet, internet is actually kind of good right now, there are some certain games that I would like to play. Also, I would like to have some game recommendations as well. I, I think I already asked like um, a few times and um, people um, recommend me uh, some Kirby, right? Kirby, I think he has Kirby. I'm still surprised there was an error in the stream until now. Yeah! Yeah, that's right, boy! 
We fix the internet. I'm using Ethernet internet for now. Like, well, five dollars. Thank you. From who? I like burning. Thank you for the donation. Like uh, I, some somehow it's not um. You used some necromancy on that internet. Yeah, I fixed. I fixed it. I um. I bought some uh, Ethernet cable and yeah, you can turn it off now. Are you wish you already turned it off? Yeah, I bought the uh, Ethernet cable, but um, at first it didn't. I couldn't get it to work, but uh, <clears throat> but then I realized that the um, the LAN port in my laptop wasn't working properly, so um, I bought this uh, USB uh, converter and yeah. Worked wonderfully, and um, Kuro Black Feather was, was the first victim to, to test it out, and it went out really well. So, yeah, no. So, no, no more fuck up Wi Fi anymore. So, yeah, so um, when everyone got back, it kind of got, it's gonna got a little bit. Um, Background noise, yeah. That's actually like a TV noise. Chinese movies and all that stuff. Also, I'm, I'm, I'm just calling it um, Lunar New Year, not Chinese New Year, because um, there are a lot of countries that uh, celebrate the uh, Lunar New Years, not not just Chinese. So I'm just um, calling it generally Lunar New Year. I'm uh, having a. Uh, I'm probably have to um, finish that commission sometime next week because I want to get it done. I, I want to get it done. So um, yeah. What do we have this week? Uh, this is chatting stream, so um, I think on Sunday it will be. Uh, oh yeah, Valentine. Yes, it's um, is it? Yes, Sunday is Valentine. We're gonna have a Valentine stream. Yeah. So yeah, wow, well, that's that's actually on good topics right there. So yeah, if you don't have. A Valentine to celebrate? Well, come to my stream. Um, it was oh yeah yeah yeah. It was actually um, on this Valentine last year that I was just sitting down in the office. I was like, "Fuck! I want to be an anime girl." And yeah, this is how the all the VTubers going on. Oh god, that's a lot of noise. But never mind. That's how it started out, right? You want to be an anime girl, like, um, yeah, Kuroka 06 over here was actually the original idea, but, um, but as a final phase, I thought, I made up my mind that, um, you know, just, just being, um, 100% male is, um, more comfortable. Just, just me, just be you, right? Just be you. Yeah, like um, like a thing. If you want to be a VTuber, turn to an anime girl. Yeah. You know what? I'm, I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna have something like um, turn into an anime girl in my um, push point redeem, something like that. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's how that's how it started out. Yeah. Mhm. Mm so yeah, probably I'm gonna watch the um my debut. Rewatch my entire debut. How long was it again? Like um from nine to eleven. I think it was um about three hours or something. Yeah, it was 
look how how far we have, we have gone like this we have, compared to to the first time when I debut I um, and I have proper overlays backgrounds and um, all this overlays which has thing alerts and I, I think I still have alert but uh, whatever like um, smooth I, I don't think it's like uh, 60 FPS or something but um, mm. and uh, not glitching as well that that's important because um, the first the first part of bottom game after my debut was like holy hell it was glitching and it's with green and and black and everything glitching like literally glitching it's like diariku but um it's not uh, gonna look good aesthetically yeah it did not look good it looks terrible and i had to end it somewhere around an hour after that stream and give everyone an apologize and uh ugh, that's cringe that's cringe that's very cringe well look look where we are now like um Stable internet connection. Finally, you come far. Yeah, come far. A long, long way. Like stable internet connection is probably the revolutionary thing. Yes, yes. Okay, enough with the head pad. Shut up. Shut up. The the fixed internet connection part is revolutionary. Like if it, it was if it was like um two or three weeks ago. It would have had disconnected or glitched, buffering or anything, black screen for at least uh, two or three times during this whole stream. And um, look at us now, like an hour and a half to the stream, and no errors at all, like people said. I remember the um, the the. Um, Two months debut anniversary stream the other day when I play Gambit 2 with the boys. Um, was it um was was a stream like um three hours and a half, and when when I look at the vods, oh wait, what is three hours? Two hours, some something like two and a half hours, and um, when I look at the vods, the lag time was add up to one hour total so YouTube cut up all those one hours and um, the boss is only one hour and a half or, or something like that it was terrible I I just want to say thank you for for everyone to come into my stream and it was the, the, the disconnect would, would jump into the middle of my mouth between my lines and um, you know I went my it was a thumbs up rules that uh, when I look at the uh, bit rate and my OBS, that uh, if, if it reached uh, zero kilobyte per second, I would stop talking. Because uh, if if I talked, it would got cut out and nobody would hear it, right? So yeah, that's that. Well, say goodbye to those old days. Lack, lagging it just uh, lagging is, is a thing of the past now we, we have stable internet connection I have I haven't had that smooth GA2 fights for years damn god so good man I thought with what uh, of about you know a day yesterday some something the other day and um, damn I can actually see where he is <laughs> not glitching at all not glitching it was so good so so good like have never been smoother yeah so um, because of that I actually have uh, can can focus on more stuff I want to do on streaming. Like this is when I actually streaming, you know. Like 
is a whole revolutionary like Twist Brittle let me use chat I well that's now nah, I can really help with that though I I literally don't didn't know how Twitch works Um, probably it's just on your side. You just check some stuff out. Maybe it's just your co your connection or something. Because I'm I am sure right now I I am not disconnecting anymore anymore. So those times are in the past. Okay, so not me. It wasn't me. If it was me, then it it wasn't me now. It's not me now, right? Those, those laggy times are over. It's just a smooth stream. No, no more scuff stream. So because of that, I, I actually uh, can focus on um, on these stream content. And yeah, I am um, thinking up a, a few games that I want to play, and uh, I already have have a list on my hand. But just because I have um stable internet connection that doesn't mean that uh, my PC is not potato I'll go bang away Wi-Fi again yeah you should you should that's that's kind of, kind of weird because um I it was just like um two months ago when I first debuted it I look at my um, I look at my alarm for me to wake up it was like I I needed to wake up at 9 a.m. That I stream my debut at 9 or 9:30 a.m. or something like that, and I needed to wake up at uh, 7 or something. And I set an alarm, and there was an alarm that said um, "Bow's debut," and that's crazy. Like, um, yeah, I I set an alarm for Artemis and Bow's debut, and. I changed that to my debut. That's 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 how the weird feeling, you know. <laughs> it's crazy. That's that's how how it began. Mhm. Mm and um, yeah. Still though, just because I have um, smooth Wi-Fi, that doesn't mean that my PC is not potatoes. That's that is still in the progress. I have. Optimize it uh, like 70% uh, up up my laptop right now, and I'm still looking for ways to uh, for it to uh, go even more. But uh, I guess that's that's all I can do for now. So I'm having a few games up my list, up my my uh, want to play things that. Um, I had a list before my debut that I have games that I want to play, right? And uh, one of them is um, Undertale's General Cyrus. Yeah, Gen General Cyrus. I'm actually gonna, gonna have to try that. I just saw that they brought the Snytron back. Uh, mm, well, what of it? I. Snatron. It's Snatron. What what of it? Mastery Fodder. I'm still surprised that it can run Monster Hunter. Uh, I Yeah, Mastery Ranking Fodder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Snatron. I got a Snatron once before when I asked uh, something like uh, eight or ten mastery rank. Wasn't even that good. Not gonna lie. It has a punch through thing, but uh, doesn't everything sniper has punch through? And I'm not even liking snipers that much. I like it at first. I love the Ruiko, but uh, the more I get into a game, the, the less uses it has in, in the later gameplays. So I use it less. And yeah, I had had the Snipetron run down. I already sold it. Same to Snipetron. So um, yeah, I'm not gonna get that. I already uh, got the um, the wings ephemera, so it's it's, it's kind of lit. Not gonna lie. And yeah, I can still run Monster Hunter at um, 
low quality and um, not streaming. While not streaming, it's still a little bit lag. That I'm not even streaming. It was heavy as hell. It was uh, kind kind of kind of a bit slower than usual, but um, when when playing by myself, I can still play play it at low uh, low quality. Need to load now. Good luck. No problem. Have we lunar you you to you too? Yeah, no problem. Yeah, so um, I can run games like Warframe and uh, Monster Hunter World and uh, Code Fine, God Eaters, all kind of stuff on low quality graphics when playing by myself. But uh, when I'm streaming, I have a PRP Live that go with my live model, which is this. I have OBS, I have uh, YouTube or there's a browser open for YouTube Twitch streaming yeah so um, I have those and plus the game so that is like uh, three or four more times heavier on my PC so yeah my PC just got four times heavier on the uh, render and Oka shits and streaming so uh, there, there are usually two solutions to this is that um, either get a beefy PC that, that can handle all those shit or reduce the share the load to a second PC and both of them require a new PC uh, but um yeah, I'll just stick to uh, the uh, retro games like um, Game Boy or DS. DS is also heavy. I tried the Kamen Rider games before. It's also very, very, very heavy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, I'm just gonna play less of a DS game, but um, I think I haven't tried the GA uh, get a, uh, Game Boy Advance games. I can also play PSP games, right? It, it still runs. It still run damn fine. Now, now that I have um, the uh, Ethernet, Ethernet, and, uh, Internet and thing connected. And yeah, we're not gonna play Parapon again. Like so, goddamn. I might change my mind later, but um, for now, I'm I'm done with that shit. No, like, um, Paramount is, um, not gonna lie, Parapon is very, very cool. It's a cool game, cool mechanics, like, um, game of the year of, of some, some year, I don't know, but, um, while playing it, it's very hard to, uh, also have myself talking and paying to attention to the chat and can correct, interact with the chat while keeping the, the rhythm, right? It's very hard to keep keep up with the rhythm during those and and interact with the chat as well. So um, it's cool, but um, not really. Same same to go with the uh, other uh, other games. When you get a new computer, would O9 become a Twitch redeem? What do you mean? What do you mean? Maybe, maybe. Maybe I'm actually gonna get get something when uh, my uh, I when I buy the new computer. But uh, about the Twitch redeem stuff and the emotes and all kinds of thing that um, related to Twitch athletes, um, um, I'm probably gonna fill up. One more condition uh, during this week that is a stream on seven unique days. Yeah, to reach affiliates by by the end of this week. So that um, the only the only last thing I need to reach affiliate is the fifty followers. Yeah, if I remember correctly, the uh, the path to affiliates the condition was. Um, Having average of three viewers, having total of uh, something something watch time, stream on seven unique days of the week. It, that I have to stream 
stream at least once on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Like at at any weeks. But I had I need to have stream it on at least one of those days, each once. And I need 50 followers. So let's just assume that I, I already filled out um, three of those conditions and I need 50 followers. I think I have something like, uh, I don't know, let me check. I have 33 followers. Oh, wait, what? That, that is like a 10, 10 more than the last time I checked. Oh, hold on. Hmm. I have resist, but um. Pepe, thank you. Cosmic Benny, Ray Grace, C. Kaze, Jagon Slinger, Sauce Non, Mike Wolf, Kuro Blackfeather, my boy, my boy. He just collaborated with me at the beginning of this week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aya, oh well. Ginaku, yeah, Ginaku also donated uh, $10. That's cool, that's cool. The other day. I think it was this morning for, yeah. And May as well. May, thank you for the follows. Yeah. Hope you all have having a nice time at my stream. Well, is it? Well, we'll get there. We'll get there. It's just like time. It's just a matter of time, right? Oh, it's <laughs> easy, my hello. I mean, yeah, like um, I didn't think that uh, reaching um, athlete would be that that easy. I mean, uh. On YouTube, I, I think you need like no, 1,000 subscribers or something to uh, reach a partner on YouTube to unlock emotes and members and stuff. Twitch, it, it just need this, 50 followers. So I, I need 20 more. <laughs> yeah, 17 more, something like that. And we'll have those cool spit emotes, the <laughs> dumb shit and all kind of emotes. Emotes and redeems and bits, all kind of things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mhm. Mm so yeah. Mhm. Mm that's that's what you need. But um, you know, like I said, it's just a matter of time. It just keeps streaming, like. And about that, the, having this new internet connection, it's it's a fucking game changer, like. It's a game changer, man. Like, imagine how how many people would leave my stream due, during those lags, right? Like, uh, what what are you gonna gonna do? That stare at the uh, spinning circles? That's freaking annoying. Yeah, no one gonna do that. So when when my stream lagging and I'm trying to reconnect, my my viewers just just like went went all the way to zero. Are you going to miss YouTube? Uh, we're actually uh, still going to stream on YouTube. But uh, I'm gonna lean more on Twitch. Specifically, I'm gonna stream uh, something like a uh, four four Twitch stream and three Twitch and three YouTube stream, like uh, a stream every two days. Yeah. So uh, after this, um, after this is uh, a Valentine stream this Sunday. I'm probably gonna turn to uh, stream on YouTube on next week. So yeah, there's no problem on that. I'm still going to to uh, stream on YouTube because uh, the thing about Twitch is that uh, it has little uh, discovery thing, right? The the um the exposure, yeah, 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 yeah. It's had little exposures. So I still need YouTube, like stream on YouTube and uh, uploading clips. That that said, though, I I still have a few clips uh, that I still need to uh, to upload on YouTube. I, I that I haven't, which I really should. I haven't edited them yet because uh, it's like a yeah. But uh, yeah, I should. Yeah, so I'm still gonna stream on YouTube next week, but. Um, we're gonna have uh, something like three stream next week. One of them is gonna be uh, finish the commission that uh, I already uh, canceled this week. I mean, there's a lot of stuff. Like, uh, I wanted to uh, finish that commission this week, but uh, somehow my Wacom kind of fucked up. 
So I end up playing Warframe instead and uh Guys, like no to self, never trust elevators. Take the stairs. Don't trust the elevators. Goddamn. I beat the Lafontis two times. Two times. Damn it, Lafontis. Sort the sort the level mission and 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 the elevators just, just get me stuck in there. It, <sighs> Damn it, it, it was it was like uh, I don't know, like 12 a.m. God damn. 11.30 or or some shit. Damn it. Fuck. I I beat LaFon this like two times. Commission and talking streams end up being my favorites. Uh for some reason, yeah. I I don't know why. I, I don't know why as well because uh when before I kinda like uh you know I consider like uh, drawing streams are boring. I really consider co drawing streams are pretty boring. I, I don't know why. Because um when I'm I'm don't I don't like what watching people drawing. It's like uh you know just just like one two strokes strokes and especially if is the um, the streamer is not talkative it's get even more boring because it really depends on the uh, the streamers to uh, spice up those boring time during those streams you know because it's just drawings this is nothing for you to watch there it's just just you chatting with with the drawing the streamers but yeah and somehow the uh, game stream is not really that that attractive for some reason yeah, because uh, you know because I feel like uh, when when I'm too focused on other game I don't have a uh, much uh, time to interact with with the viewers and for some reason like uh, there's no no viewers interact to me back during those stream as well because uh, they were watching the gameplay like uh, they, they will they were watching the gameplay, you know, like, um, mm, yeah, they were watching the gameplay, they, they're not, not even uh, responding to, to my, to me talking, like, I, I don't know if, if it's not, uh, interesting topics enough to talk about, or anything, it's just, uh, people just don't talk, <laughs> just don't talk to me at all do, during those gameplays, because there's, they were busy watching the gameplay. It's like I, I don't like, uh, you know, force you to to have to chat or anything. But that it's just the, a thing that I have to work on. <clears throat> but yeah, so um, in the end, com commission and talking stream, yeah, it's actually the, the one that works out the best. Yeah, so actually, is the one that works out the best. Because, you know, just games or... Yeah, like, so, back on that topic, I, um... Probably next... Collapse? Collapse? Oh, yeah, Collapse. Um, yeah, but, you know, like, um... I'm probably not, uh, doing Collapse as much, but... Uh, if you watch me long enough, you probably would, would have known by now. Yeah, but, um... I'm still thinking on uh, inviting uh, my boy Kuro Black Feathers again, and also um, asking uh, DB Terra, Deep Blue Terra, and uh, Mino Candy on playing a tabletop simulator as well. As uh, I checked my uh, my Steam earlier, the tabletop simulator is having 50% discount on Steam. So uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna, gonna get on that. What the fuck? So yeah, I'm I'm probably gonna going to uh, get that get that game yeah 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 no I'm, I'm definitely gonna get that probably after, after I I already talked to Mino and Terra before on the stream so yeah they, they said they would really like to to play that game but um, I would have to make it official and and DM them on Twitter or something sometime so yeah, mm. hey Mino, yeah, 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 it's a shark girl, shark girl, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
she kind of, you know, like, um, <laughs> Mino really has this, um, either Ungu energy or Gremlin energy, and, uh, yeah, most, most of the time when, it's, it's like, uh, when, when she's on her stream, it's like, uh, mostly on, on her Ungu energy, but when she's collab or when she's tweeting, it's Gremlin energy. <laughs> yeah, I re really like that girl. Hmm. Terra Minnow, yeah, 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 yeah. And Kuro Black Feather as well, like uh, the forest going going to play some board games. Um, there's a thing about this that the uh, board game thing is uh, probably no one's gonna know the rules of any games, but uh, we'll figure it out. There's, there are probably some guys in the some of the board games. I love board games. I love board games. I still usually go go out with my ear in real life friends. It's Shark Girl Fetish? Um. Um, not really. To be honest, not really. Like uh, I have, I've seen a lot of Shark Girl VTubers around here. Like uh, this Gura, Gal Gura, this Artemis of Blue, Mino Candy, and uh, her so-called daughter uh, Mako. Mako, yeah, Mako, Mako. And, uh, I'll, but, uh, I mean, Shark's concept is really cool, but, uh, yeah, there's a lot of them. There's so much that you, you can basically call the the v VTuber community a, a fucking aquarium, a big aquarium. Or a zoo. God damn it. Or a zoo, something like that. Or a zoo, a big zoo, a big zoo, yeah. Like you know, cat girl, dog girls, like uh, spiders, dragons, universal zoo, yeah. Also, don't don't worry about the background noise. But yeah, so. Uh, but I I just I got into this uh, VTuber. Yo, don't get DMCA with the background sound. Uh, what what exactly can can I get DMCA on that though? Is I I doubt Twitch will uh, recognize those things. Or are they? They probably will. But uh, yeah, no shit. But nah, probably would not not get DMCA. It's Vietnamese stuff, you know. The only thing is have more dragons and cats. I mean, cat girls are are fucking common, right? Cat girls are freaking common. I actually don't see much dog girls. Yeah, I actually don't see much dog girls. Haley are is a dog girl, but I don't see much of them. I want an N VTuber. Be an N VTuber. You want an N VTuber? Be an N VTuber. N man or, or some kind of that. Well, I just just like me you know because uh, she's she's kind of a friend, you know. She's because uh, like I said. The uh, VTuber model is just um, is is what draw your attention, but what uh, the the things that keep you with them is their personality. Like I always said, she's just a very very a good friend. Yeah, kind of. Like also reminding me of, of my in real life friends that I usually uh, go out to play board games. That she also had a boyfriend, but, but we uh. We three are still, and another guy as well. We are four, yeah, make a four. But but that that dude is like, uh, it's a bit, yeah. We four still uh, go hang out sometimes, and yeah. And Mino and Terra really gives up their vibes, you know. Something like that. Although uh, Terra is probably more bottom than than, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, they are nice person. Nice people. I actually uh, get some first interaction with, with me now before I even announce myself as a VTuber. Yeah, something like that. So she's she has been giving me support ever since then. Like um, she also gave me some advice on the uh, commission price and all kind of things. Like uh, when. 
when I do this VTubers, decided to do this VTuber things, I have to do a lot of things for the first time. I shop online for the first time, made my own shop for the first time, commissioned for the first time. Oh, hello, Grega. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Happy Lunar New Year to you. And as to the tradition, here's your lucky money. Yay. There you go. There you go. Good, good. Wish you happy a lunar, a happy lunar new year. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, Ter Terra and Mino are are good people, and um, they're a good friend. So uh, I'm probably gonna have Kuro Black Feather, and by the way, Kuro is uh, debuting on early March, as he said. Most well, supers are best. Uh, yeah, kind of. Well, um, yeah, well, they are good. Not, not actually my fetish, so I mean, they, they look good. But my main fetish is still Twin Tails. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. My main fetish is Twin Tails. And Tigers. Yeah, you, you, you will know when, when I get into drawing stuff. Yeah, I actually want, want to draw some something in recent day, but I just get too lazy to do it because it's holiday. It's holiday, you know? But, yeah. So, yeah, probably I'm gonna invite Mino, Terra, and uh, Kuro Blackfeather for a collab on a tabletop simulator sometimes. Sometimes. But, um, you know, you probably should, should not... Uh, I expect much collab from me because uh, I'm kind of well, you know, yeah. So I'm actually still have a lot of games that I want to play. Right here, I have a Cosmic Breaks. I have Helix too, and uh, I have a uh, the Genocide Undertale Roots, Undertale Genocide Roots as well. Which one do you want, want me to play? I have Cosmic Break, Helix 2. Uh, the last last time I played Helix, it's, it was pretty good game. Pretty good game. Did you say Cosmic Break? Yes, I just said Cosmic Break. Yeah. It was um, Cosmic Break was fucking dead. Like when when I came back to get him a two, like the. Uh, I don't know. A while ago, like I quit and get about two US for like um, a year or so because uh, I can handle those lack over there. And uh, yeah. it it was actually spelled the helix. Ace. Y L I C S Helix Cosmic Break, yeah. Cool, Cosmic Break. It's Undertale. You still still need to uh, improve your writing tier. Yeah. But yeah, so uh, Cosmic Break is kinda dead when when I uh, rediscovered it again. So yeah. No no just uh, Well it's just just a thing that, that you have to you know pay attention, you know. But yeah, Cosmic Break was fucking dead, and then suddenly, recently, I saw it all over the place, like uh, on Twitter, on Facebook, and, and I found it on Steam Store, like what the fuck, Cosmic Break Universal, I, I fucking thought it was dead. Cosmic Lake is dead, Cosmic Break was dead, and now, and now it's, it revived, and just like, damn, I had, I had to try this thing, I had to try this thing, I had to get into it. Yeah, but the thing about Cyber Sam is they tend to just leave this game to fucking die. So I was really, uh, really surprised on seeing Cosmic Break. I mean, they have fucking ultimately awesome design game, and yeah, it wasn't until they decided uh, to bring it back. I don't think this this was the from. Uh, from uh, Cyber Step anymore though. I think it was some something different. I don't think Cy Cyber Step would ever touch Steam Store. But yeah, I um, 
that's why I'm asking. I'm having a few games that I want to play right now. That uh, the Helix 2, the last time we played Helix, it was a um, surreal clay game. The surreal clay game Helix. And uh, I finished that game, and now I got uh, Helix 2. So I have Helix 2, I have Cosmic Break, and um, Undertale Genocide Roots, something like that. What do you guys want me to play? That is what I'm asking. Because uh, all of these are really good games, but you know, there's only so much time. Oh yeah, there's also this game as well. Grip Syndrome. Grip Syndrome. It's also a game. The uh, Madoka Magica fan game. Yeah. Fortnite. Bullshit. Get the fuck out. Not playing Fortnite. We are not playing Fortnite. No Fortnite. No Overwatch. No uh, League of Legends, no Apex Legend, no Valorant, Minecraft. I uh, I'm neutral with that, but probably not. No, no Fortnite. Cosmic Breaks looks nice. I mean, yeah, I uh, guess the battle royale. Right? Exactly. No, no that. I had get a bit too. That that's the only. PvP shit I need. But it was a shit. No. I took it personally. No Fortnite. No Valorant. No Apex Legend. No no uh, CSGO. No uh, Overwatch. No uh, League of Legends. Stuff like that. Mo Astray. Oh yeah, Mo Astray. I uh, have, haven't checked on that on Steam, but... Uh, yeah, I, I saw I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. So yeah, Mo Astray. That is also a thing. Classic Break is a legend and a classic. Yeah, it's a legend. It's actually uh, under the same uh, creator of uh, Get It But and Get It But Two. So those those game are the the most the most famous of uh, Cyber Step. But uh, you know, cyber step. They just left left the fucking game today. Persona Five Strikers. I would have to fast that on Steam as well. I would have to fast that on Steam as well. But um, Mo Astray and uh, I I don't know if my my PC can be able to handle that. Don't. Why not try Don't Escape Day 4? Don't Escape Day 4? I actually have, have never heard of that game before. Let me check. I've never... Pixel game, Don't Escape. Is that a horror game? Or... Is that an escape game? Hmm, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Survival. Hmm. Survival. Some of the guns didn't spit out any deadly projects. I would have dry clicks they refused to It's interesting, not gonna lie. For this in the wasteland. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. I am I actually gonna try this out. At 19, instead of trying to enter the house for living on 19 years stuff. Interesting. Very, very interesting. He says no, but karaoke stream will definitely happen someday. Uh, karaoke will definitely not happen, okay? No. We'll not do that. We are not doing that. Not, not with all these people around, and uh, pro probably my my dignity would would never allow it. 
Nope. Yeah, hope it's up. Yeah, I probably will will look into this one. Yeah. That's a lot of things. But yeah, I'm actually. I'm actually got to try this one. Don't escape series usually has has a heavy lore. Yeah, I I really like heavy lores. Heavy lores. Don't escape for guy. Don't escape for that. That means there are. Don't escape one, two, and three, right? That that's all interesting. But I actually don't. Mm, the char character design really not not really uh, catch my attention, but the uh, gameplay is kind of look stories. It actually looks looks very interesting. Not gonna lie, it's, it looks very interesting. Yeah, I might actually got gotta try this one. Oh, it's on, on sale as well, but um, yeah, I might also DC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna uh, check out those one as well. But um, since I'm kind of saving right now, so uh, I'm probably not just gonna buy it yet. But it looks very interesting. Not gonna lie. That looks very interesting. The game's combination of traditional point and click. Ooh. Classic survival elements. The finished product and game that ensure one to play very well put together. I'm, I'm reading the reviews. It's like point and click survival. Hmm. Well, but I will check it. I will definitely check it. But for now, I'm just gonna. Yeah, it helps. But yeah, I'm I'm probably gonna. Um, I just want to uh, pick up these games that I have already bought because uh, I'm. Uh, I want to save it a, a bit to buy a new PC. So uh, there's this Helix game, either Helix or Cosmic Break or Undertale. You pick. What do you guys want to see? Either Helix, Helix Two, sequels to, to the previous Helix. I already had a uh, two stream of the Helix, the surreal clay game, featuring the main character of the uh, Wayne the uh, Crescent Head, Yellow Crescent Head guy. Cosmic Break. Yeah. I know you would say Cosmic Break. Cosmic Break Universal. That. Uh, Cosmic Break, hmm, interesting. Every Cosmic Break is gonna be like a Cosmic Break. Oh, Cosmic Break as well? Hmm. Yeah, Cosmic Break, I'm gonna start it fresh. So, yeah. It was, but I guess this is a Cosmic Break then. So, yeah, prop. Yeah, okay then. Well, I guess is that it is. I probably gonna play uh, Cosmic Break. Hmm. I think I'll try it uh, somewhere around next week, and um, somewhere around next Saturday. Yeah. By the way, I'm streaming on YouTube next week. I'm gonna have three streams, right? On uh, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Yeah. So yeah. So probably next week I'm gonna have uh, yeah I'm probably gonna try Cosmic Break somewhere around next week and I'm gonna finish the commission as well and uh, I will think of something to fill up in the last slot but yeah that's uh, probably the schedule and this Sunday is gonna be the Valentine right so if anyone don't have any Valentine's to celebrate, you can come to my stream. We're gonna watch the the, uh, the debut, my debut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reaction to to my old debut. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna watch the whole thing. The, the whole thing, okay? The whole thing. I'm gonna watch the whole debut reaction thing. It's gonna be cringe. It's gonna be cringe. And uh, I probably just did a skip on the uh, the intro part, in the uh, loading screen. But yeah, I'm gonna watch the whole thing. On um, yeah, because uh, when I started all the other thing on yeah, like I already said, I started it like last year Valentine. I just want to be an anime. Oh, are you kidding? Your debut was awesome. Well, thank you. Thank you, but, um, well, I guess. And you know, like, uh, seeing me now and uh, looking at me back then, it was, you know, like a lot of stuff, and there was a lot of things I could have, I could have done and I could not have done. And, well, I'm just gonna give some, probably give some comments on that. Yeah, but you know, in the end, like um, like I always said, the models it's uh, you gotta track to one VTubers because of their models. But uh, in the end, you stay for for their their personalities, right? So yeah, I'm probably gonna go with that. Well, I'm probably just gonna leave it like that. So. We're gonna go for, yeah, Cosmic Break next week. I'm gonna start out fresh, I'm gonna finish, I'm gonna finish the commission, the last commission slot, and start out Cosmic Break next week. I'm gonna try it, yeah. And uh, yeah, this Sunday is gonna be Valentine's stream, and again, if you don't have Valentine to celebrate, you can come to my stream. We're gonna watch, rewatch my debut, reaction, and commentary. Yeah. So I'm gonna. We're gonna end it here today. Thank you everyone for watching. We're gonna rate someone. Like, uh, anyone has any recommendation on the rate? Because I don't know much people. We're gonna rate someone. Let me see. I'm gonna rate someone. Sezoka. Val. Wait, Val for still alive? So I don't exist here. Val for still still alive? Val for. Oh, Val for still alive. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna rate Valor for and we're gonna rate Valor for Falconery. And everyone, yes, as always, spam in the chat. Blessed by blessed by the Black Sun. We're, we're really gonna have to uh, agree on this thing. Valor for Falconery. Spam in the chat, blessed by the black sun. Falconery, just a sec. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna raid on Balfour, blessed by the black sun. All right, I'm gonna raid in. Well, thank you everyone for coming to uh, this uh, small Lunar New Year chatting stream, Friday chatting stream, and yep. Thank you everyone for coming to watch me today and I'll see you next time. Otsukuro des. Hi, we're gonna rate Val for Falconery. Nah, nah, nah. Right now. Alright, alright. Let's see how it go. And roll the credits. Alright, thank you everyone for coming. See you next time. Hey.
Do you leave sketch with anti-aliasing? I don't know. I I don't actually know if I sketch with or without it. Thank you for the follow. Mm. Oh, thank you for the uh, raid, Masanori Kurooka. Thanks for the follows as well. Thank you for the raid. Welcome raiders. Welcome to the stream. Hmm, what should I say on the uh, tweet when I post this? Oh right, I should say that congrats on the debut. Mr. Debbie, which is a shame. I miss Garo's Debbie. I was passed out also during that oh. stream. Uh, hello, 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 people. Love your model, man. Thank you very much. Yeah, Monchi is very cool, very cute. I want to draw with her, like, you know, a drawing collab. She mentioned a, like, draw pile collab is actually pretty fun. I don't like draw pile, it's ass. <laughs> it's to draw on. I mean, like, something not, not exactly like a draw pile, but like... Yeah, something similar to that, together. but like... A better program, I'd want something yeah. like that.